Methylprednisolone is better than radiofrequency ablation for treating lower back pain caused by facet joint syndrome. Lower back pain is one among the most prevailing musculoskeletal problem in adults. In lumbar facet syndrome, certain degenerative and traumatic reasons affect the facet joints within the lower back. One of the recent studies has emphasized the outcomes of radiofrequency ablation and methylprednisolone in treating facet syndrome. The study was conducted to relate the efficacy of radiofrequency ablation and methylprednisolone in the patients diagnosed with facet syndrome. The patients included in the study were the one who were diagnosed with lumbar facet syndrome. The study was a comparative study in which 100 patients were included. The patients were equally divided into two groups. The patients in group 1 were administered with a 2.5 ml mixture of 0.25% mupivacaine and 40 micrograms of methylprednisolone acetate, and the patients categorized in group 2 were subjected to pulsed radiofrequency. The study outcomes were measured using visual analog scale and OZUS3 disability index. During the follow-up period, it was observed that visual analog scores of the patients in both groups reduced significantly than the values before treatment. The scores at third and sixth month follow-up varied significantly between the groups. The OZUS3 disability scores were significantly reduced after receiving treatment with methylprednisolone. When compared to the values prior to the treatment, the scores of group 1 patients at 9th and 12th months were recorded as significantly lower than the values before treatment. The study concluded that methylprednisolone injections were much effective and can be preferred over radiofrequency ablation in treating facet joint syndrome.